Hey, it's Pasty Prime here. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 3, where we are continuing on our, I guess, our first playthrough of this. Uh, we started as Petty King Machad, I think it was. We then became somebody else I've forgotten already. And now, and that was in the last video, and then we ended on the last one, I think, with the death of uh, him. And we are now High King Constance. Mac Donchad, that's who we were. Hiking Donchad before of Ireland. So, yes, we have a new king and we are playing as a new person. So, what do we got to do? Let's have a look. Nominate a successor. You have not cast your vote for the title heir to the kingdom. Uh, do I even have... Your player heir, son. What? I don't look old enough. 43. He's 22. Oh, I guess I am. He just looks older than me. Um. Alright, well, we might vote for him, I guess. If we're going to vote. No? Uh, why can we not vote for him? That's weird. Why can't we vote for our... Your player heir, son. I'm not sure. Oh, because you are under... You're a vassal of somebody else. You're a vassal in the Holy Roman Empire. Okay. Did I deliberately do that? Was that my silly... Silliness? Maybe. I guess we're going to go for our other son. Okay. We have empty seats on the council. The heir is unmarried. All right. Well, let's have a look. What do we got? So five years difference. Not lowborn. You're Irish. Generous, arrogant, temperate. Uh, you're pretty smart, too. You know what? We'll go with that. Oh, my God. It's scaly woman. Oh, well. We will do that. Uh, we haven't chosen a lifestyle, either. Uh, oh, hang on. What? We are very diplomatic. So I would think we'd go down Diplomacy. Okay, so we already have all that unlocked. Um, what is our trait? Hang on. What are we? We're stubborn, generous, temperate, adequate bargainer, diplomat. Okay, flagellant. Handsome and scarred. What does that all mean to us? Uh, you can never have too many friends, near or far. Diplomacy plus three. Regality flows from ritual, tradition, and glory, or family focus. Even if we do not choose them, those closest to us are the most important. I don't know, actually. Nothing jumps out at me as saying that's what he would be.
Uh, da, 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 da. I'm gonna go majestic focused. Okay. Uh, yep. Right, that's that one done. Now the empty seats. Do we have any powerful vassals? We do. Okay, how many were? We one, two, three, four. Okay, so let's have a look. Who's who in the zoo? You are really bad, right? Oh god, your strength is in learning. That doesn't help at all. And a steward. Oh, probably makes sense, actually. So, for that one there, we're going to pick that guy. For that one, we will take Oh, she's already considering a proposal. Uh, okay, well then we'll grab you. And then... Let's just get it playing for a second. Okay, so she accepts that. Now we can put her in there. Uh, now we have to put this guy in and he's not good. Do we really have to? Uh, well, I mean, you don't really have to, but it makes sense to do it. Okay, so that's what we got. What else we got here? Uh, we can ask for gold. I don't know if we'll get it. Uh, you can make alliances, you own line to inherit several titles, to election, children like guardians. Uh, what are you, what are you good at? You are good at stewardship. Perfect. You can do it. And then Seb Brian. You are good at diplomacy or stewardship. Your brother in law. Yeah, we'll give him a shot. Okay, so you've got alliances. I don't know what I want to do with those yet. And we got some of these things. Uh, can grant vassals to rightful liege. Why would I do that? Uh, Duke. Why? I don't know why I would actually do that. I'm not sure. All right, let's just get this moving because we need to do something here. All right, what do we do about our cities here, cities, towns, whatever. Okay, what would we do? What, what have we got? We've got a camps, cook, hunter's lodge, bastions and curtains, wooden barracks. You've got more knights. Military academies. Royal armies. Uh, what does that do? Jousting grounds. Does that improve their performance, does it? 
You can get more taxes. With the tax office. Uh, yeah, da, da. Let's go with that one. Alright. I don't know how often you should build things, but... I don't know. I just think we should do something. Now, what I would like to do... So, hang on. Is that not my... Oh, is my main... Spot Dublin? Oh. Okay, that changes things. Why is that disabled? Because you do not have the title Merth. What does that mean? What's the... I don't have the title yet. Current holder is this guy. Okay, interesting. Okay, so it says I have that. Okay, so we can't afford any of that. What's our army like? Uh, my niece, Eleonora, has given birth to a son. Okay. So, was this one that we were going to declare war on? We were. What's his, uh, what has he got? 2,000... We could easily test ourselves here. So, how about we do that? Force vassalization of Prince Kaswalan. Is that him? Yes, it is. You cannot afford the cost of this war, so upon declaring, you will receive the following effects fame penalty. Okay, well, I guess we'll wait. Because I can't afford it. It's all quiet. Too quiet. So we're increasing control over here. We're not making any other claims. Mainly because it costs me money. Can we declare the war yet? Wait, what? Oh, is it because of our... It's our prestige. Wait, what? Fallen Sun, the conflict between Messen and Zeus interested me little until my council's summary of the Battle of Sangenhausen appeared. I know immediately that something terrible has happened to my son. There amongst the dispatches it reads, We confirm Prince Constance was killed staunchly resisting the Zeisian pikemen. 
He was slain by Count Rudiger, uh, spy master of Duke Conrad, in a fierce encounter. I could not, I could not have saved him, but no parent should outlive their child. Rudiger will not get away with this. You and Count Rudiger become rivals. Uh, okay, Prince Constance was killed. You gained 40 stress. That's going to be critical. Okay, or oh, no immediate effects. My brave son, Prince Constance was killed by Gunnar. You gained 40 stress. Either way. Okay, do we, uh, do we want a rival? Sure. Okay, I'm already stressed. Great. I swore to avenge the death of Prince Constance, who was slain in battle. Alright, uh, so you can pin him. Alright, we're gonna do that. Right, let's have a look. Life has never been easy, but it feels like the loss of my cum, my cum? son, Constance, has pushed me over the edge. I still remember him as baby, so tiny, so fragile, despite that he survived growing up, growing older until now, when he suddenly stopped. I had so much hopes for his future, so many things I wished to see, which now can never come to pass. What is the point of in eating when the hole is in my heart? It is hard, but Guy can help me get through this. Who the hell? Oh, that's my wife. Okay, and I must press on. It is what he would have wanted. So you can still stress 36, stress 30. Uh, what, is, what does that give me? What is that? Is that the empathetic? Um, we will... Your wife will get you through it. Social manipulation. The first time it happened, I barely even gave it a moment's thought, but my nephew, Duke Jacob, has grown bolder. His challenges uh, no longer pass unnoticed among my vassals. He is testing my limits. The others are sure to follow unless I give him a taste of his own medicine. What is going on with this guy? He doesn't like us. He's my nephew, vassal, and knight. Huh. I will ignore him and steal his idea. What's his idea? Uh, you gained 50... Will, ha will happen. You gain 50 diplomacy lifestyle experience. Possible outcomes. You get a weak hook on Duke Jacob. Uh, he gets 20 opinion. Uh, he is not fooled. He loses 15 opinion. Outwit you. You spend 150 prestige. And, well, I don't have that. Oh my god, is there any sure... Is that in that one? How dare you challenge your high king? Duke Jacob loses five opinion of you and you gain ten dread. Yeah, I reckon we're gonna go. We're gonna go with that. Alright, I'm just gonna pause for a second here. We're gonna have a look at this guy. Oh, we can declare war on him. We could do a murder scheme. Ah, oh, that's not going to work. Okay, there's no way we're going to do a murder scheme on him. So where, where is he located? Okay, are we going to play hunt down the, uh, hunt down the place again? Spend all video trying to find somewhere that I can never find. Okay, 
surely. Got the county of Gorlas, which is where. I can't, I really struggle bloody finding things on these maps. I thought it highlighted stuff. Why am I not seeing the highlight? Are they that far away? Probably is actually. I mean, it's not that, is it? No, that's mine. Oh, forget it. Forget it. I can't find these people. It's just annoying. All right, what are we going to do? Right, so look, hang on. Let's have a look at this. We have no holdings. We are useless. That's not what I wanted. Okay, why are you not very good? Uh, okay. Uh, so you would definitely be good for patronage. Okay, it's a duchy building. Building disabled because you do not have the title. Meth. Well, how do I get the title? He has the title. Okay, I can revoke his title. He is a powerful vassal, which... Oh, it's this guy. Now, he's going to be upset if I take it off him. Uh, I don't have a hawk. So I want to take that off him. Yeah. You have been overwhelmed by stress. I see no choice but to bow to your decision to strip me of the petty kingdom of mouth. Oh. Okay. But now he is not... He's not a powerful vassal anymore. Okay, so now how do I grant myself the title? Or do I... Okay, I'm confused again. Here we go. Why, why can't I click? No, I want to click on the act. Why will you not click on the city? Oh, so it's not disabled anymore. So it's now mine. Ha 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 ha. Okay, I wonder what that cost. Did that cost me? Because I could just go and take everybody's titles and give them to myself, could I? 
Okay, except we do have an empty spot, but we'll work that out. My nephew Duke Jacob has proven himself highly capable, especially in mar martial matters. There are some projects I would like to undertake in the earldom of Tommond, my liege. Will you, with your blessing, of course. Uh, take the reins. Courage improvements for five years. Alright, we'll let him, we'll let him have a go. I'm heading for my chambers to enjoy some blessed sleep when I hear a faint rustle from a window. Just the wind, I think, until the wind starts to speak. Uh, Lemna, open up my beauty, it is I, dinner tush. I push the shutters open and lo and behold, a man has climbed up to Dub Lemna's window. It is my brother, Prince dinner tush. Really? Okay, by the Satan, have you no shame, guards? Characters close to Dublema who dislike adultery lose thirty opinion. What the heck's going on there? All right, I guess we've got to go for something now. Your brother-in-law. Wait, you're a powerful vassal, Duke Jacob. Oh, you're very good at martial. Oh, okay, what are you... Ah, oh, God. Okay, this is crap. They're all crap. Okay, I really would like to get him in this position. So I'm going to put him there. So this guy's not a powerful vassal anymore. Oh, actually that, that works out pretty good. I do like that. You will be assigned to integrate title. The target title becomes de jure, part of your primary title. Uh, will be assigned to domestic affairs. Is this, this one here? Okay, yeah, 70 years? Jesus, hope you're not in a hurry. Um, we are 129 prestige, minus 129 prestige. Uh, my daughter-in-law has given birth to a daughter. The sun is shining and peasants are milling about the tawny hosted by my wife. All my knights cheer as High Queen Gaia announces the tournament in their honour. And for once, I get to simply sit and watch. I'm not going to spend an entire tawny day stuck to a throne, however. I too cheer to my knights. Gain 20 opinion. Okay. Uh, well, this day is in our honour, my dear. Um, every night again. Well, I really like 75 prestige, that's for sure. Okay, now, what is all of this going to do? Let me... Imagine if you made an enemy of her. OK, 
Okay, you can't revoke her titles. He's not your direct vassal. Uh, okay, so you basically... I'll find what I'm doing. Here we got vassals. So why can't I? Okay, so you can't do it from her. I could revoke his. May incur a tyranny unless you have a cause for revocation. Of course. And I'm guessing I don't have hooks on any of them, so that's fine. Let's just leave it alone. I'm proud to see my daughter no longer as a child. Uh, let's come to naught, however. She's a thrifty clerk. Okay, we have to get a few things up here because we're not really... Okay, so we could flagellate. You'll lose stress, you'll gain a trait. Eh. What if we... Do we go on a hunt or go on a pilgrim or hold a feast? Host a feast. We host a feast. What does that give us? May increase your vassal's opinion of you. Do a hunt, you reduce stress. If you're going to pilgrimage, you get piety. I thought you got... Uh, oh, you can't... Yeah, prestige. All right. Let's go on a hunt. Uh, hunt, rude vassal. Just as my courtier, Costen, started to dismount one foot still in the stirrup, my tedious nephew, Duke Jacob, made sure to bump into the horse, sending him stumbling across the camp. You're acting like a child and will be punished like one. Gaines tasted the belt for five years. Loses 20 opinion of you for five years. This is no way for a duke to act. You gain Mediator for five years. He loses 20 opinion and he gains 30. Or, ha, huh, Corston has gone red as a beat. Hmm. Ah, uh, what are you? 36, 36. You're both similar. Um. I don't think I, I'm not going to belt him. We'll mediate. Yeah, this is a bit annoying. We can't even start any wars because we are so weak. I would be delighted if your daughter Sedby could visit my court in Holwick to meet her peers. I hope she will attend, as I will miss her a lot if she didn't. Um, of course she will be there. Hopefully there's no issue. My beloved niece, it has not escaped my notice that my niece Ma Mare is a very good looking woman. The way she smiles and folds her arms never fails to make my heart flutter. Are these normal feelings to have towards a niece? No, she's my niece. Get a grip, Constance. Well, we'll ask the question, because he's confused. Okay. 
Okay, she's returned. Now, can we do anything with this guy? Well, we can declare war, but... There is absolutely no way. 14,000. Not happening. It's just so low, there's nothing I can do about that. My daughter, Dunlaith, has given birth to a son. Very good. Are we still on the hunt, or...? Okay, we have a perk available, so... Uh, we can go benevolent, be, benev, benev, uh, benevolent intent, sway scheme power plus 30, firm hand, monthly prestige per dread plus one, befriend, you can use the befriend scheme, unlocks a challenge to board game interaction, groomed to rule, children receive one to three extra skill points. We need prestige. Now, we haven't got any prisoners. I don't know, we got nothing. We get nothing. This was a bad switch over to, uh, to this guy. He's just not good. Like, this guy doesn't have a great opinion of us, but there's no... Oh, you could get a little bit. Alright, let's try and sway him. Wait. Oh, hang on. I did something wrong. That guy I wanted down here. Man, okay. But she's not good at diplomacy. He's better at diplomacy. All right, so let's switch a few things around. So we're going to swap. Oh, he got maimed? Okay. Swap them, because he is very tough, but he's now been hurt. Severely injured, disfigured, one-eyed. Is that going to destroy your prowess? It is, but it still classifies as excellent. Um, okay, but you're not good, so we're going to swap you with this guy. Sort of the best of the best, isn't it really? Yeah. It's about as good as it's going to get, roughly, really. Because he's excellent. He's good. She's not. <laughs> All right, lines about legacy. The latest work of my acquaintance, Lord Kettlemudden, has become all the rage at court of late. The peace deals with memory and what we leave behind. And Kettlemunda has publicly dis dedicated it to me. The legacy of a high king. What man does not hope to rest when tired, no matter his wealth and treasure acquired? It is rare enough for men to admit they all that all they leave behind is shit. 
So far I've kept my thoughts to myself, but the buzz has grown too dramatic to ignore for much longer. I don't quite know how I feel about this. Uh, 60%, you gain 20, you gain 50, 20. Uh, Kettlemander, I can see this is truly heartfelt. 20 opinion of him. Uh, we'll take that. Propose an alliance to the benevolent High King Constance of Ireland. Despite our lock, lack of bonds by blood, I believe we both stand to gain from an alliance. I propose that we join our forces and fight our foes together. Gain 20 opinion of Court Lord Kentelmunda. Where is Lord Kentelmunda? Lordship of Brianchen. I don't even know where that is. Oh, and again, I could go and have a look. Oh, no, he's popped up. There it is there. So that would sort of stop me taking his thing. Not that I could anyway. Uh, propose an alliance. If I decline, he loses... Okay, I'm going to accept his. So what happened to our hunt? Did it finish with nothing but that one little thing? Sorry, we're missing 61 gold. Are you, we're not even at a thousand. At least we are. So you're telling me if we get 61 gold, I can do this. A holy order of your faith will be founded. You become the order's patron. You gain founded holy order for five years. Pope Constance II gains 30 opinion of you. Uh. So I notify when this becomes available. Okay. All right, I'm going to ask them. Oh, it's available. Should we do it? What does it mean? What does it do? I don't know. Let's do it. With your support, Grandmaster Amlab has founded the Order of St. Patrick. Okay. So, we did a major decision. I don't know what it means, but we spent all this piety. Okay, you're in line to hear it. We're second in line. See, we don't even have the original main area. And this is being attacked. Okay. He's stupid. Um, she's my daughter. Can we go for a matrilineal? This one. You gladly accept. Okay, so we have a lot of alliances we could form.
Oh no. Man, what? Oh, God, we're back to her again. Ah, uh, she's the best one. Ah, oh, this is so annoying. What is this guy good at? He's good at diplomacy. What's this guy good at? Okay, he's back at stewardship. All right. Okay. Right. Let's put... Reassign her. Um, reassign him. And then give him a spot. Innovations are technologies and other advances that benefit all characters of certain culture. Innovations are grouped into the errors when they can be discovered. Through contact with neighboring cultures, each culture is always exposed to one specific innovation, which will be discovered much quicker. In addition, the culture head can set another, or the same innovation as the cultural fascination for an additional boost. Okay, so they're fascinated by windmills. Now, how do you do that again? Uh, hang on, I've seen it before. Where was it? No. Well, we'll look in here, though. We have the... Where did I see it? Where was it? Innovations. So they're interested in windmills. Okay. Well, it's already picked it anyway. Well, we'll stick with that. Oh, I didn't know there was a faction. I clearly missed that. Where do you come from? You've created a faction against me? Wants lower crown authority, military power. Okay, no, not yet. Okay, what do we want to do? Um, we could try and boost our, our army. Uh, I hereby invite you to a feast at my court in Dun, Prague. It will be a grand affair worthy of your honourable presence. It will be my pleasure. I have more important matters to attend. Uh, we will go, and we'll hope not to be killed. Every guest is gathered in the Great Hall, and our gracious host, Duke Adra Bra Brandon, has welcomed us all to the feast. I look forward to this. Um, yeah, I'm wondering whether to... Could increase Sadby comes of age uh, with sufficient every child 
Uh, oh, she succeeded at something. Cannot go unmentioned. Her lessons have given Sabi valuable knowledge for her, for her future life. She gains the traits skilled tacticianer and reckless. Okay. Somebody died. My sister died of gout. She was gout ridden. Okay, so he loves us. What? Why did this guy just change clothes? Uh, my daughter, Sabish, has given birth to a daughter. Okay, so we've got 10 months, 9 months left on that. 52 years still on this thing. Merging titles. That is a long job. She can marry too. Yeah, I'm probably being silly doing all these matrilineals, but... Is she gay? No, she's heterosexual. What? That looks like a girl. Is that a girl or a guy? No, it must be a guy. Whatever. Oh, you're quick. Temperate, wrathful, zealous. Oh. Um. Okay. All right, I'm just going to go with that one. Okay, what is the point of this? Uh, I guess we'll grab the new perk. All right, so monthly prestige per night plus 2%. Yeah. As I said, we not we want prestige, so we're going to take that. Now, in theory, we could probably go and start a war, could we? Okay, let's have a look. Vassals can be granted to their rightful liege. You can transfer a vassal to their rightful liege. Vassals who are not at the rightful liege of give of give you fewer. Vassals who are not the rightful liege of give you fewer resources and have a reduced opinion of you. Sometimes it is best to grant these vassals their rightful liege, presuming that they are also your vassal. Sometimes granting a vassal to their rightful liege means that you earn less, but that's usually worth to grant them anyway. Their rightful liege will have a steep opinion penalty towards you for holding a vassal they think is theirs. Keeping a good vassal structure is the key to a stable realm. Okay, but is this... So you want to grant her... She's my vassal. Okay, so I'm granting this guy who's currently my vassal to her, and she's my vassal. Okay, we'll do that. And her opinion will jump up. Then you got this one here. Man, she is getting a lot of vassals. Okay, well, as long as you stay my vassal, but that, will that break the faction? I think she needs to go on my council. Yeah, because they're not my vassals anymore. Okay, I finished reading the latest letter from the Archbishop Trenchard and smiled. He seems to have warmed to me at last. 
While this is a success, I am tempted to use the opportunity to try and get even closer. But he's already... He's already 100%. This victory is enough. Yeah, we're going to stop. Because he already likes me. Okay. Right, what are you the best at? You're the... Oh, for God's sakes, you're a marshal. Ah, oh, come on. Right, you're marshal, you are steward. What are you... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Why, why have I got such rubbish? Man, these powerful vassals are horrendous, but I really should give her, because she is really good. Okay, so she's not good at diplomacy at all. He's even worse. Oh, man. Good luck. Can we get some powerful vassals with a bloody brain? Because these are horrendous. Alright, so she really, really likes me. I'm going to sway my wife. I want to start getting all these uh, levels up a little bit. Right, so let's have a look what we've got here. So what what titles do we have? We have Athlane. Ah, oh, we have that one. Okay. Well, that's got yeah, okay. Uh Alright, you need 400 to construct a new thing. Uh, we can increase our army again. Bowman. All right, we'll leave it there. All right. Um, yeah. Uh, I'm still not sure what I'm doing here or how it's going. We should think about possibly coming over here and doing a war. But we're going to do that in the next video because we have hit the time limit or gone over it, actually. So if you like the channel and you want to support it further, check the description below. There is a link to a Patreon site. Uh, where you can sign up for a, a small monthly membership type thing um, to show your support or you can click on another link which is to a virtual coffee which is a small single donation type thing if you just like to give something to the channel to show your support and that sort of thing to help buy games and all that sort of stuff uh, but obviously there's no obligation to do that everybody is welcome here uh, if you want to show your support in other ways, you can uh, like the video if you liked it. Uh, if you didn't, you can obviously dislike it as well. And if you haven't already subscribed to the channel, please do consider subscribing. It really helps the channel out immensely, and I really do appreciate the support. It just helps the channel grow, you know, get more reach on YouTube, more features, all that sort of stuff, and um, shows that uh, shows how many people like the channel, I guess, and the content that I'm making. Most importantly, leave a comment below. Let me know what you think of the game. Let me know what you think of how I'm playing. And feel free to give me advice, tips, all that sort of stuff. I'm really new to this game. And uh, I'm not a bit of a, a history buff. So I struggle from that point of view. But I'm enjoying it. 
Uh, it's just I struggle with the concepts and how to do this and how to do that and who is that and where to find things on the map and all that sort of stuff. So, you know, if you if you are experienced and you want to give me some, some help, feel free to do that in the comments. Uh, or if you want to ask me questions or talk about anything at all, just games or share something about yourself or ask me a question, whatever you want to do. I read all the comments and I answer every comment that warrants an answer as soon as I possibly can. Hopefully you've enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and I will catch you in the next one.